<laughs> We're here again. Woo! Back with my mom. Oh my god, I feel like I haven't seen you since the last mukbang. This is our little outing. Is our mukbang outing? So, um, I'm so excited for this one. We I went to. This uh, is your feet on it. Well, I guess we can show. And I wore my I wore my pearls for you guys. I love the. I know I should wear my pearls. Let me get my eating outfit on. I know, I know. Uh, me too. Because I didn't get the memo that we were wearing blue snowflakes because I had blue snowflakes and we could have worn it. it could have been matching. It could have been twins. Oh my god, they like made this. There was no drive through at the Dairy Queen. Shout out Dairy Queen and Oxnard. We drove literally thirty minutes to get here. Actually, more because we were in traffic like an hour. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and there's no drive through, but they make it like super fresh. So I'm like really excited. Oh, they had cheese curds, you guys. Oh yeah. yeah. Okay, let's get into uh, this. Let me get my boots. Oh my god. Yeah, me too. My me too. I have no shoes on. I'm like, okay, we're getting comfy. We're getting cozy. Look how big pizza. these box are. They're so big. Oh, it's like can't see. Oh, okay. You know, oh. I was just thinking today. Some people d aren't into food like that. Like, it doesn't get them excited. Oh, people who aren't excited. Oh. Look at those. Those look so good. Actually, look at the mm -hmm. steam. Oh my god. And yes. these pretzel oh bites. Gosh. Okay, these pretzel bites look really good too. Wow. The queso. Oh my god. Oh, oh my yeah. chili dog's gonna be really good. You could dip the curds in the queso. Mm -hmm. Well, we have napkins up there. You want a napkin? I mean, it's totally fine. It'd be messy. Yeah, be messy. Okay. Do you want one on your in your lap? Oh no, but I got that chili dog. Oh my god. My this must be cheese curds in here. One of them. One's chicken strips and one's cheese curd. Oh my oh. god. <gasps> and they're like so crispy and well done. Look at those. Shout out really to Wisconsin Monroe's <laughs> the State Fair. They had the best cheese curds. Really? Anyway, hi Wisconsin. -ers. Oh my god, these look so good. Look at uh, the packaging is beautiful. Wait, oh my god. Wait, let me yes. see my um chili dog oh my it? god oh wow oh yeah there it is there it is we're gonna get ice cream after too but the food looks really good i'm really excited it's almost better than we understand so wow oh my god we were gonna go there oh we god. gotta do that one too oh my gosh i've been wanting cheese curds they had them at white castle mm. oh my god this is a large this is a huge cheese curd. all right mm. oh my oh. god oh mm. Mm. Right. these are worth it alone you know what I mean? Mm hmm. Mm. Wow. wow. Really good. Mm. That breading is amazing. It's a perfect crunch. Oh my God. Wow. Mm. Mm -hmm. Fill up mm -hmm. on happy. Okay. <laughs> is that what it says? Yeah. Wow. Oh, did you show them these? Mm hmm. Damn. Well, you show them again. They're like so well done. Mm -mm -mm. Look at all of them, you guys. Mm. Mm. I went. I Mm -hmm. I don't think I've been to a Dairy Queen since Rockford, Illinois. Mm -hmm. When I was 17. And we were just talking about mulattes. And we did those all the time. I mean, well, how long ago was that? Um, 15 years ago? Yeah, more than that. They have 17. them there. Mulattes. We mm -hmm. might get one. We're going to get one. No, definitely get one. Mm. I remember after Kill Bill, mm -hmm. we went to Dairy Queen. Because it was right there by the Rockford Mall by Fridays. Oh. Um, yeah. mm. There's not one near us either, which is probably good. We go there all the time. These are so good. Mm. But, I don't like cheese. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. They're so delicious. Wow. Mm -hmm. It's seriously the uh. best. I was like, okay, I have to stop. These cheese curds are so good. Addicting. Mm -hmm. They're better mm -hmm. than mm -hmm. chips. Mm -hmm. They're better than mozzarella sticks, too. Oh, yeah. Mm. They're juicy. I kind of like that, mm -hmm. huh? But I'm so in my happy place. Oh, my God. Me, too. Oh. Wow. Mm. And these were so good too. We should have large onion rings too, so you could take them. Back. I know. I've heard well, we're going back in. We could take some more at home. Mm. Air fryer. Mm-hmm. This is so good. I'm eating my chili dog. I'm just shook mm. by it. Wow. Mm-hmm. Let's try. Oh yeah. The pretzel mm. sticks. Now okay. the pretzel sticks look a little little, but they look good. Mm. Remember Sonics? They had big ones. Mm-hmm. Mm. I think they were more. Me and Moses had Sonic from right before our maternity shoot, and it was so nasty. It was so not good. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, they're pretty. We we'll take them out. They're pretty long now. Let's see. You're gonna dip in the queso? No, I'm gonna try my. Well, you tip it first. See if I like it. <laughs> <laughs> if I like it, you won't like it. Mm. Mm. <laughs> it's okay, but it's not really creamy. Creamy yeah, cheese. it doesn't look like something I would like. Maybe it's like that kind of cheese. Maybe. No, it's queso. It's got jalapeno in it. It's like pepper jack cheese. Oh, okay. I don't mind pepper jack, but... Oh, try it. Mm -hmm. No. Just a little corner. Okay. For the people. 
Oh, there's like weird green stuff in it. It's um pepper jack cheese. It's oh. like jalapeno. I don't mind it. Yeah. But mm. I don't mind it. It's kind of jalapeno y. Mm hmm. You like jalapenos. Okay. You used to get them on your nachos. Not so much on my cheese, but. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. <laughs> Pretzel sticks are like whatever. Uh, Any yes, reason? Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And they made it fresh. We were like waiting in there for like 10 minutes, 15 minutes. We're the only ones in there too. Oh, made... how do they stay open? But, but why this? I haven't gone to Walmart either. I don't think since the Rockford. But oh, yeah. This is a brand new one. It's like huge. It looks really clean. I know. I haven't been to Walmart in so long. I went on Black Friday. Or like before Black Friday. I know when I saw so that. Much. That's like that's so random. It was random, and I, I thought it was gonna be cooler than it was, but you know, it was it was nostalgia to go there. I was like, okay. Pioneer Woman has her stuff there. Really? Maybe we'll be in Walmart. Used Maybe Jacqueline Smith from the Charlie's Angels era, but really? I guess she's not popular. Anymore. I'm not against it. I want to have my skincare line in there, so you never know. Mmm. 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 You are good. Mmm. There's a raisin canes right next door, so it's hard to compete, but. Mmm. Mm. Oh, it's good. It's good. Good. This kind of reminds me of the um, Rockford Mall too, though. What? Oh no, Dairy Queen wasn't it? Maybe it was Burbank. That, that had a Dairy. Burbank. Yeah, they had the Dairy Queen with the nachos. Oh. oh. <laughs> I got nacho cheese chips. Mm. That's very good. Mm -hmm. So good. I love messy food. Me too. Unless we don't lick your fingers on. I feel sorry, but I know that's where all the flavor is. They cut them off on your fingers. <laughs> I'm parent, maybe their parents said, don't lick your fingers, and then they always did that. So <laughs> they told the people, don't wait, really? Them. That's so funny. Oh. Mm. But I used to pick out my teeth, like peanut butter Cheetos. I would just take my finger in there and like go like this, like get it. Peanut into butter it. Cheetos? No, peanut butter or Cheetos. Like, if I was stuck in my teeth, oh. I would just take my finger and get it out. <laughs> I'm like, well, mm. actually, Cheetos. Has a new flavor. I saw it from Stacey Burks on Instagram. What? Mexican street corn. Mm. Cheeto. I love it. I don't know how that would taste, but I love them. Real, yeah, the, real. it's always weird when they try to do it like a chip format or something. There's only one I really ever liked from Lay's. Not so much Cheetos, but was um. Oh, not for that. <laughs> what did I like? Lay's loaded mm -hmm. baked potato. Those were the best. Yeah, those like flavors seem weird. Like, how do they get that flavor in the chip? <laughs> Secret. I don't want to know because I'll just buy theirs. <laughs> you want chicken tender? Uh, sometimes people. Hmm? You want chicken tender? I'm not going to eat them all. I'm only eating mm. like two. No, not yet. Are you sure? Okay, well, we'll take them home if you don't want them, but you can have one while they're fresh because they're good. Mm. Mm. I think this girl's recording us across the world. No, she is. I know. They've been uh, sitting in there. No. Oh, I hate that so much. Like, it's so... That feels like, oh, my God, like, I'm an animal in a cage. Like, I get it, but, like, you have to sit there and record things. Oh, she saw me looking at her, so she put her phone down. Sorry, but... That's... I just hate it. Yeah, it's so uncomfortable. for the whole time? Mm hmm So she puts it up. Man, you know, my buck man. Whatever. <laughs> mm. It's so weird. Like, mm. say hi, don't say hi. Like, don't... Work. I don't know. I just... I don't... That's why, like, it gets so weird when I see people out in public. Like, oh. I saw the guy from Lost sitting behind Angel at, um... What restaurant was that? Javier's. And I was obsessed with Lost at the time. Oh my God. I wanted to so bad. Just take a picture. All I wanted was like a picture of him. But I was like, you know what? That feels so weird. I hate when people do that. It's like, you're not like, you know, either say hi or don't. Oh my God. That one is like. This is like a quadruple one. Mm -hmm. oh. It's like the double <laughs> chips. The uh, ultimate. Oh, I said, she's curd. How is it? <laughs> mm. Oh. I haven't even posted our in and out one yet. I edited it, but I forgot to post oh, it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I didn't thought there was so many. That one. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Come on, boo. Hi. I know. We're going to go home to her. She's sleeping. Yeah, she was sleeping. Mosa with her now. And then when we go back, he goes to lunch. And then we go hang out with Malibu. It's been, yeah, I feel like I haven't seen you because it's been so busy, honestly. Like, just so much happening. Like, with our anniversary and then Christmas and Hanukkah, or it's Hanukkah and then Christmas. Wow. Oh. He's got family coming in. I got my family coming up. Like, there's just a lot happening. But you guys been doing so much, you've been doing so many videos. I don't know how to do it. I post every day to three channels. So, and I, that means I have to also edit and upload everything. 
and film. <laughs> so like today I'm like filming. It's actually not a filming day, but I was like, you know, I haven't seen my mom in a while. So I was like, okay, this is like a good thing. It's like a fun thing to go do. I did you was on live your last five minutes. Oh yeah. That's fun. No, like the last twenty minutes, because you got early. You came at like ten twenty. Mm. I dropped my price for post offers. <laughs> so you five people are getting your stuff. There's P eighty eight Christmas. We got more stuff coming up. Yeah, we can take a box with you. Mm -mm. As long as you, there's no mouse in it. <laughs> I get scared. I see it one time and I'm like scared. No, they've literally been sitting in their car for the past like 20 minutes. <laughs> I know. Staring over here. It's like, I know. On. It makes me not want to get out. Oh my god, we want to go get ice cream, but we'll get it. A oh. big circle. I'm a nobody. Mom, you are somebody. Everyone's a somebody. Okay. But not everyone gets filmed from like an animal. <laughs> I love saying hi to people. I do. It's like the best thing. When people don't say hi and they just like, because you don't know if they're making fun of you on a TikTok, if they're filming you or what, you're, you know, I was like, oh, it feels so weird. I don't know about these fries though. Let's see. Really? Yeah. They're average. Next, I mean, these cheese curds and onion rings are like, oh, outstanding. Really good. Mm-hmm. And then they have these little Texas toastings, but they don't look that good. That's good as Warriors and Canes. You want one? You don't want it. Mm-hmm. You try it and see if I like it. <laughs> I have to cleanse my mouth of the chili. I know. It's very potent. I feel like you should have gotten a bigger, a bigger, um. Water? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> They're so funny. They came out with, like this huge bag from Wingstop. Mm. Everyone's getting food around here. This is the place to get food. It's like a food court outside. It really is. There's a Wingstop. There's a Subway. It's weird. Baskin Robbins and, yeah. um, what do we call Dairy Queen are so close to each other. I, like, I, I know it didn't look that good. That's why I was like, no. Okay, I'm glad you tried it for the both of us. No flavor. I'm gonna put it back in. No. Well, I don't care. Though. The fries are kind of whatever too. Oh, this the chicken's be average. Longest fry, and I'm gonna be eating it. <laughs> I don't think it's the longest. Mm. <laughs> I mean, I love fries, but that's not that it's good. It's a little different. Mm -mm. Not like boiling crab. Mm. No. We're going to no. go to Boiling Crab and not get crab anymore because we just like the um, chicken wings, oh, the fries. Rice. And now Moses gets like a hard boiled egg in the thing. So it's a hard boiled uh, egg, the corn, the potato, the rice. And that's all we like. We're like, we don't even need the crab because like last time we went there, mm. I just was like, mm, this, cause the last couple times I've been a little fishy. I'm like, you can just have the crab legs. He's like, you don't, I'm like, I, he's like, I don't really like the crab legs. I'm like, oh, well then oh. we should just get that. <laughs> I know because I got, you guys get the rice. And you put something on the rice. We just put corn and sauce on the rice. I'm like, <laughs> and then he eats the potato, and then we eat a ton of fries, and, it, and then we get the chicken wings now. I'm like, those are kind of everything, and they're really good. Like, so that's our new order. <laughs> We're not gonna even get crab. <laughs> Callie likes the crab though. She comes with us. We'll get the crab, but or mm. you like the crab? Mm. You never eat it. And I was like, eat the crab. I like the spice. Oh, that's right. Yeah. I come for the French fries. I know. Um, what do you get a boiling crab French fries? They're so good. No, they're really so good. We should make crab legs though, like from Costco. They have gotten so expensive, though. Oh, really? Like, to get maybe three. It's like a hundred bucks. Really? I'm like, I don't like it that much. Well, I think it's going to be like, cheap, yeah, mm -hmm. like 30 bucks. Now they're like doubled. Oh. Oops. So weird. I guess save the crabs. <laughs> mm. <sighs> Inflation. Everything goes up in prices. Our carpeting was like three times what we paid for it when we moved in. When we got carpeting for our room in Malibu's room, it was like three times the cost of what it costs to do with the other rooms. I'm wonder why. Just things are hard to get over here right now. I guess. And yes, I am dipping this in my queso yet that I've been Oh, so you do like them. Okay, I over. do. It's okay. Kind of over the chicken. I mean, it's good. But if you want some, you can have it. Otherwise, we'll take it home if you want some. And then I'm over it. It's good. I'll try it. It's good. I just tried for you guys. <laughs> That's a part of the mukbang life. I'm, I'm a chicken butt. My mom's giving up. She just gave up soda. And I'm like, yeah, I'm going to give up soda in the new year. But I'm also going to try and give up fast food. <laughs> because I eat so much fast food mm -hmm. lately. I've been so obsessed with fast food. It's been tasting so good. But this isn't considered fast food because you have to go in. You're not going through a drive. <laughs> so, well, you know. Right. I know. <laughs> what? Coke, guys, yeah, I had to give up Coke. I gave up my Red Bull. I. You did? I did. I, I thought, feel so much energy. This morning you were like bouncing off the walls. I was like, man, you just had a Red Bull. No, I gave it up because I think it was affecting my heart. Mm, that's probably and, true. Um, then I went to Coke. I love Coke. Real Coke. Coca-Cola. <laughs> have three Cokes a day. I'm just a little one. But oh. uh, every day, though, uh, that's not good. Mm. 
I'm, and I'm like, mm, I have to get, have stop because I joined the gym. I'm like, okay, I'm going to try and get healthier yeah. and drink more water because I would drink Coke before we drink water. I used to drink, I love water. And they water. say Coke dehydrates you. Mm -hmm. If you drink too many Cokes, you're going to be high. So I'm like, okay. When I was pregnant, I like drink water all the time and I was always peeing and I swear, that's why I didn't gain any weight when I was pregnant. Like I just gained like mm. water weight and swollen weight. But since Did I you birth, drink soda? No. No soda, no coffee. Not really even fast food. Yeah, yeah. really good chicken. Yeah, that's good. I mean, probably not as good as Raising Cane's, which is, like, right there. But, <laughs> it's good. What oh, was I? My dad, oh, I remember my dad's receptionist, <clears throat> when we were, were growing up and we come out here, and my dad had a company called DIP, there was a receptionist, and she would drink those, you know, those big gulp things from 7-Eleven, like those jugs? We had some. Um, she would drink three of those of Coca-Cola a day. Because <laughs> I always asked her what's in it. She was oh, it's Coca-Cola and stuff like that. And she would drink three. And I remember we'd go to like to go fill it up with her. Like, if we wanted to get out of the office, like, we'd like, go with her. And she'd fill the thing up with Coca-Cola, drink the whole thing. She was you guys want to go back to, like, wherever it was. I don't know if it was 7-Eleven or somewhere else. And we're like, yeah. And she'd fill it up again. And she'd drink three of those a day. Was she skinny? No. <laughs> mm -hmm. But, but um. it was, like, a way to get out. Like, she, like I think she use us as an excuse because she's like oh i'll take your kids out and like you know so they have something to do and so my dad's like okay so she could go three times a day to get this big thing you know <laughs> so we'd go with her and she always called me trish like fish she was just a chuck trish like fish like she'd always like do that she's like what you got it from or did you know before no no i kind of no i didn't what i didn't get it from there but i like just remember that now i was like oh she used to call me trish fish i have to give her a shout trish out fish. i guess she did i think her name was Amy. wherever you are i know I'm i wonder about if any you. of my dad's employees like remember me or like know that probably not they're probably all older like if they know that i'm on social media probably you don't forget if you work for somebody and their kids are always there kind of like their dogs are always there well, well just in the summer <laughs> mm. we should spend the night sometimes at his office building <laughs> but it's fine because we like played in boxes <laughs> you want some more fries no this is so good mm. oh so you know when i when i don't i don't usually go to mcdonald's but sometimes when i work out it's like one and i haven't eaten yet so I always would go get a large Coke. Mm. Oh, that was my thing. Don't know but, but now, I don't know. It's more calories, but I only go maybe twice a, a week now. But I chocolate shake with a oh. quarter pounder plain. Them don't eat. They're not even close to Shake Shack's burgers, though. I don't. And they're just as much. We had Shake Shack yesterday. It was so good. I saw. Oh, I I had that bag. No, it was like so good yesterday. Like the bun was. Mm. Like I really thought I was pregnant because the taste. My taste buds were like exploding with how good it was. I was like, wow, this is like really good. Oh, and amazing. they're the same price as McDonald's. Mm -hmm. That's cra That's so crazy. Oh. No, Shake Shack is. We should go there sometime. Nothing. <laughs> Okay. They're really good. They have a peanut we gotta butter shake. We got to walk in too, but we can go, we did this. Oh yeah, I've never been in there. Moses always gets. I've never actually been mm. in there. That's his spot. He loves it. Nice to meet you with him. But, huh? Oh, maybe we said this last time about the Shake Shack tip. <laughs> oh. Wait, we just did. Oh, maybe it was it. In and out when we're. <laughs> we just talked about food. We talked about the same thing. <laughs> My mom, I know you haven't brought it up. My mom does love to talk about the same thing. <laughs> I never don't want to see you. That's right. No. I you haven't brought it up this mukbang. You brought it up in the live. I'm sorry, you haven't brought it up yet. Mm. Army Hammer? <laughs> When Moses did the crying emoji laughing, I'm like, what's he laughing at? I was like, oh, and then when he said, I'm like, oh, he's crying at the Army Hammer. Because every time we saw my mom in summer, she like, Army Hammer, Army Hammer. I'm like, yeah, I told them to watch that documentary. It's you really know what? Good. Maybe we will. I feel like cause now we have nothing to watch. Maybe we will. But you know what? We should just watch this because my mom keeps talking. White Lotus about. is over. We That's love. true. Oh, White Lotus. I want to be on the next season of White Lotus so bad. I'm just putting it out there. I'm going to do an ASMR White Lotus. Like, I just love White Lotus. I feel like I could be on She's there. She's coming I mean, back as well, we Tanya's away. sister, Trisha. No, I think they could like because her name was Tanya and I'm Trisha. I swear so. they never called her that much. No, it, oh, we were just saying this too. We couldn't think I'm of never... one person's name from the show. I'm like, because even the character I dressed him up as, Michael Imperial. I'm like, what is his name? And I guess at the end they called him Dominic, the dad that was in the three generation. I'm like, when have they ever said his name was Dominic? Like, they really don't say their names, so I had no idea. Greg, they said because I kept saying Greg and Portia, the assistant, but hers you heard all the time. I don't know why. Tanya, Portia. Yeah, yeah. Oh my. I think it's like Jennifer Coolidge, you're like, Porsche. Like, yeah, I just feel like you heard her voice saying Maybe. it. Maybe. Where is she at? No, but like, you I didn't. She told, first of all, don't want to. She told her assistant to stay in the hotel room because her husband didn't want to see her because they were supposed to be on a romantic honeymoon. Oh. And the girl would come out and eat. I'm like, the, your boss told you to stay in. You know what's so interesting? She paid for her. Yeah, you guys like binged it. So it's like interesting to like know that because like I forgot about that at the beginning when she said like don't you know you're not supposed to be here like you know stay in your room like I forgot but that now makes sense why he didn't want the assistant to be there if you guys know but don't we won't spoil it <laughs> but that's no, you but know she's out 
eating out, meeting guys, having sex. Like, <laughs> wow, I wish I was an assistant. Get paid. I know. Actually, I maybe really want to go to Italy as a con. Because Kardashians went to Italy, I wanted to go there. Then White Lotus was in Italy, and then there was another show on Netflix called From Scratch that was in Italy. I'm like, I really want to go to Italy now. What? But hopefully, when Malibu can eat pasta, then I'll take her to Italy. Cause but all you saw him eat was fruit. They must be fruited out on that show. Oh yeah. Well, the couple they never really ate. The couples always were like so skinny. But I feel like the parent, the the boy, the men did. The one took like a blueberry in her mouth. The one had a melon. What? Piece. Yeah. Really? They always just just stick fruit in their mouth. <laughs> but at least they ate. Yeah, you're right. But it shows where they don't eat. Yeah. Why would they never eat pasta? Um. And Kardashians used to eat a lot. Not a lot, but at least they'd go to restaurants and have their food in front of them. But now they don't do that. No, they do, do they? but they never eat. Remember that pizza? They had that big pizza. Well, that's the only one I remember. <laughs> no, they went to a couple places. And I remember or when they had the beginning episode when they all had the buffet. And they're like, oh my God, I eat so much. They had like the chicken wings and the mac and cheese. And then Chloe's always saying she eats after the match. And, oh, I'm going to have pizza and donuts. Like they always say they're eating. And I don't doubt it, but it's like... They really push the narrative that they can eat whatever they want. But, like, ultimately, at the end of the day, if you're going to be thin, unless you're just naturally thin, like, you really can't eat whatever you want, especially when you're older. Like, you do have to watch it. That's, like, unrealistic to say, we just eat whatever. I don't know. I like the Maybe they say they really want to eat, and then they get there, like, oh, I shouldn't eat it, and then they don't. Yeah, I think there's probably something, because Chloe was called fat for so long, and she was never fat. So there's probably something in her head where she, I mean, I get it. I'm the same way, although I still haven't. I'm not in my Chloe era yet. I'm still... I just, Jennifer Coolidge gives me, like, confidence. Like, I just love her on that show. Like, she's not tiny or petite, but she's just so, like, everyone loves her, you know? She's just, like, that character, and I'm like, I'm gonna well, be like that. She's mm -hmm. got people that think to make her clothes for her that make her look okay. Well, she, you know? no, she was, like, in Dolce & Gabbana. That, that dress, the top that I had, that was Dolce & Gabbana. I already had that top. Oh, really? So the dress she had was Dolce & Gabbana. That's why I was like, oh, I have that top, too. Mm. They put her in designer clothes, but... She's just very tall. Well, she'd have to because she's a half a billion billionaire. Is she, well, she is? I thought it was on the show. Oh. No, that's <laughs> in real life. I was like, what is she? Maybe she is. Who knows? She's on everything now. She's like on a, She's on every show. Back to my cheese curds. Yeah, those were really good. Okay. The person filming us has left, so that's kind of... That's good to get out of my car. Kind of like... <laughs> um... But, yeah. There's a place behind us that's popping... Oh, it's a Michi's. That's where everyone's going. Uh, yeah. food. Um, wings up and Amici's. I see people going. Mm. Mm, but very popular. <sighs> yeah, one more and then. Mm. Are right. you gonna get to do your gingerbread ASMR though, or no? <laughs> yeah, I have two at home. I have two that I've been wanting to do. I mean, I seriously don't have like time in the day. I'm gonna try. I just sit in the background and do mine. <laughs> if I if I find time, I'm, I'll let I'm, you know. Moses fix me a microphone behind you. <laughs> You're just cute. I have a stadium one. I have so Did many videos, and I really don't know if I'm going to get them. Tomorrow, we're going to Santa Barbara. This weekend, my dad's coming up. Monday, we have filming. Tuesday, I have an appointment, doctor's appointment. Wednesday, is supposed to be filming. But then Thursday, busy. Going to the mall. Friday, it's Christmas Eve Eve. Then it's Christmas Eve. Then it's like, I don't know if there's going to be time. Like, I literally stay up till midnight doing ASMRs and, like, and like editing. I edit till 2 a.m. Malibu only gets up once now. She gets up at 4.30, and Moses has been getting up with her at 4.30. Oh, she sleeps now at 7 and sleeps till 4.30. Wow. And we give her a bath. I do my live at 6.30. Then we give her a bath, and then we give her her full bottle because she'll eat the full bottle, and then she just falls asleep. And we put her now up in the crib, so we have the little mm -hmm. monitor. She sleeps until 4.30. Crazy. Well, that's her crib. Well, bassinet in our room. We have the monitor in there and then the bassinet. Not in her separate room yet. I don't think we're going to put her separate room until she's like a year. I say they're supposed to sleep in the same room. Wait, so, she's in her bath and that, not the crib. Yeah. Oh. The pink crib, we put her down at nap time, but when it's time for a sleep at night, we put her in the bassinet in our room because we want her to sleep in our room until she's like a year. But she sleeps through that. She sleeps really good on it. And it's like really exciting. That's the new one, not the one. Right, the gray one. We could probably try and put it back in the snoo now that she's older, but she sleeps. She's like a little little girl. And then she'll get up at 430. They stay up until about 530 because I go to bed at two now. They go 5, 4.30 to 5.30. And then... Wait, you go to bed at 2 in the morning? Yeah, because I film ASMR till midnight. And then I edit. I have to edit all the videos from that day. Okay, girl. You're crazy. I know. Because I'm posting every day. It's mostly the vlog channel that's hard. Because I'm posting, like, in real time, basically. So that one's, like, hard. Mm -hmm. And then, um... I'm going to have to get the props for the ASMR channel. So then I can stay up late ordering props for the next ASMR <laughs> that I got to do. Like, it's, like, a whole thing. So, I'm always behind. So, 
Mel needs to hurry up and age so she'd be her sister. I know. <laughs> I know. It's so funny. Um, I think we were on our anniversary. I'm like, man, I really wish Malibu could take pictures of us because I wanted pictures of us together. Aww. But now we just take pictures of him and Malibu and then me and Malibu and then we can just piece them together. I'm like, okay, well. Someone did offer at the Four Seasons. Like, you just want me to take a picture? We're like, yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. It was really are special. You, are you done doing your, um, you were going to stop your ASMR podcast. Are you just doing that now once a week though? For because the people didn't want you to stop. Yeah, and I was gonna. That channel is gonna become a different podcast. I'll probably end up putting oh. that podcast on my ASMR channel. I can still do it. It's like really easy. I just couldn't do it every day because I re I just didn't have enough topics to doing? talk about. Yeah, for I, Christmas or just yeah for Vlogmas. Oh. I just between doing mukbangs, vlogging, I just ran out of things to talk about. <laughs> Did it hurt your voice though? No. It's just whispering. It's oh. opposite. It's like, oh. but the thing is, is like, like I said, I did it at the end of the day, so I already talked about everything in my mukbang, everything in my vlog. So I was like, oh. I have nothing to talk about anymore. It's like, like it's on live. I wasn't gonna bring it over hammer because we talked about it on live. But <laughs> it's kind of funny though. That's like your thing. We are <laughs> probably some of the actually same, no. It's okay. <laughs> oh no, the we vlog talk channel. About the same things ten times. No, the vlog channel was seen because I was recording my vlog when you were on the live, so they saw all the army hammer stuff because it was recording in the corner. So well, here you have it again. <laughs> <laughs> Go watch our meeting. Watch it and then leave me comments. Literally, we asked people on Over. live if they knew what, it, and everyone's like, "No, I don't know what happened." I'm like, "No, I never heard of it." What happened? Okay, so there's a black in there. Is it a fuzz or a bug? Yeah, I don't know. Still breaking my watch. <laughs> it probably was just a little buzz. Gonna kill me yet? <laughs> all right, should we go get our ice cream? Yeah. Look at this little thing that's hanging there. <laughs> Which ones do you want to take home? Do you want to consolidate them in oh. one box, or do you want to take all of them? We are taking all of it home because okay. I have an air fryer. And These are so weird. They look short, but now look, they're long. Do you want? <laughs> I'll put the cheese in them. There's a bag back there. We can put all of it in. I have, let's see. I have the big bag here. Is it this interesting? We're consolidating <laughs> the food to take. I don't know which one is what which. Is this? <laughs> I don't know. Oh. It was the funniest thing. He like flipped it upside down to show, and I'm like, "What was that?" Because he just like flipped it downside. So he's like, "Oh, to show you how thick it is." I'm like, oh, they did that on the commercial. Wait, really? That was so funny. I should have filmed him doing it. Oh. I was like, "Oh." You did that on both of them? Just that one that was open. <laughs> first of all, this does not look like the Malates. Ooh, lattes yeah. we used to have. Oh, they were yeah. in cups like this. Oh, no, I like, like, like what? Like the lids? They can't see. Like, they were like the carton board, but that's a mulatte now. I don't, I don't know. know the difference between this. Why is one up like <laughs> This is so funny. I must have had too much. I'm scared of, to, to it tip it over. Like cream. What he, like, tipped it over. Don't get sweater in that chocolate. Oh. oh get that. No. I have a napkin. Okay. <laughs> is it leaking down? Part two, dessert. All right, we're trying. This mm. is my, I got the sugar cookie, but oh, I don't know which is which. Oh. That looks like a Heath because it looks like a little chocolate coming out of there. Maybe. I don't get it though. <laughs> so funny. Why did it? Why is one way up like this? It must have had too much stuff. He didn't want to smush it over the edge. This I, might be a heat. Kudos to him. Is that heat or sugar? I don't know. Um. Hmm. Okay. Well, <laughs> we don't know. But it's really bad then. It looks like sprinkles, but this one. It doesn't look like this is chunky. Like the the um sign was like. Oh. Hmm. I don't know about this one. But it's this one. The cookie tastes a little stale. It. That's Heath. Oh, yours is dripping too. Here, I'll get you. It's dripping? I feel like I'm with Malibu when I have to like wipe her drool. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> Not you, the cup. <laughs> hey, cheers to you, Malibu. <laughs> cheers to you. Mm. Mm. Mine doesn't have like any cookie in it. Mine just tastes like My... vanilla ice cream. <laughs> Maybe it's in the middle. The ice cream's good. I have been on an ice cream cookie lately. But there's no chunk. I know. We like the Oreo Fudge McFlurry. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I already um, had chunks of um, white vanilla ice, white ice cream in it. <laughs> this one is like, mm -mm. my cookie tastes stale. <laughs> this is just not a good. chocolate shape. Wait, really? Yeah, you're right. It's good, but it's very chocolatey. It's not a moulat. <sighs> what was a moulat? I remember. It was, it was a, like a, it was like a root beer float, only way to call them. Um, what? It would be like a blender with ice cream, with the chocolate and ice cream, and it would leave chunks of ice cream in there. There's no chunks of ice cream. It is kind of weird, like this. <laughs> like just fudge right there. Mm, this is better than this. All right. Mm -hmm. You want mine? Mm mm. You have heat in yours? Okay. This is so weird. Like the cookie is not good. I guess they're a little chintzy on it. Like, it's like a little caramel cookie, and then it tastes kind of like a stale cookie. <laughs> 
<laughs> mm. Are those sprinkles? Yeah, try it. It's not good. Oh, boy. <laughs> you want to split? No. One, I'm like really full. Mm. But that's weird. I was really had high hopes. The sugar cookie looks so bum. Wait, I, I, there's something at the bottom. I saw. I felt oh. something. Oh. I think you gotta dig a little deeper. No, there's there are chunks here. Mm. The cookie's just like mm -hmm. not fresh. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. You can put still cookies in ice cream. Nobody will know. <laughs> Except you, I guess. Mm -hmm. You're the one. Mm. Mm. Well, it's weird that I like the Dairy Queen food better. Like, I came for this, and I was like, mm, the food uh, is actually better. And I thought the food wasn't gonna be good. I was like, mm, the food probably won't be good, but. Mm. I had food the first time at Michigan when I was there. Wait, uh uh. You went to Dairy Queen in Freeport. We used to get the food there. What do we have? I'd get the chicken strip basket. We'd eat inside, and then we'd get, like, a dilly bar. You got the fro the cone that was, like, dipped in chocolate. Okay, I have food. No. Oh, well, I don't know. You probably, I don't know what you ate for food, but we definitely yeah. had food. We had food. Mm. Mm. Maybe you didn't. Sometimes I guess you didn't eat with us, but, I mean, well, we always had food there. Maybe you didn't eat. I know a lot of times you want to eat dinner. Like, when we eat dinner, you want to eat. I'm like, are you not eat? What? Yeah. I always eat dinner. No. So I was like, what are you going to eat? I remember I always ask, because you never had, like, a plate for you. I <laughs> ate you guys' leftovers. Oh, maybe that was it. Because you never, ever had a plate for two. Because I was like, what are you going to eat? I always had really so weird you never ate. That could have been. I mean, you were uh, tiny, but. I was cooking all the time. Mm. And then you guys were probably already done. And then I just ate what you had left on your plates. Yeah. I guess I can see that. I can't wait to cook for Mal, but, like, I love cooking. Like, I can't wait for her. She loves watching cook. I can't wait till she can eat it because we were making jelly donuts yesterday and I was doing a taste test before we put the jelly in it I was like I'm gonna taste one of these donuts so they taste like oh they're really good mm. like, I can't wait for her to like be able to taste it or like do the dough with me the dough was so fun I was having so much fun with that dough I was like whoo you need to get her baking so she can be in kids baking championship oh I follow a kid that was on that show he's like a 20 yeah, now I follow all he has like blue eyes I think his name's like oh I know he, no he oh you would know he's like really popular on tiktok now He's a really good baker. Oh, he's on, and he always says, I was on the kids' baking show. He always says it, but I can't. I he got name. dark hair? Yeah. Dark hair, blue eyes. Like, really. I think he was on Valerie Bertinelli's show, too. He's really outgoing, really hyper, yeah. like, really upbeat. Like, I love him. He oh, follows yeah. me, too. Matthew. Yeah. Did I say Matt? Because I was about to say Matt, and I was like, yeah, that's a name. Yes. I love him. He follows him. me. Him and Johnny Cakes from the cake show follow me. They both follow me, and I'm like, mm, so excited. I love following them. <laughs> Matthew. How'd you know Matthew? He's really big on TikTok. He makes really good stuff. Yeah. Like, his cookies always look really good. I'm like, mm. <laughs> I saw him when I was little. That's so crazy. But I saw him before you. I know. You know everything. But like here's a couple years back. He was on Valerie Bertinelli's cookie show. Mm. Mm, nice kid. He was a 20 then though. He might be like 18 or something now. But he always starts off with saying, I was on the kids baking show. Like he always shows like, like a clip of him from it. He makes really mm. good stuff. Like I always like save his recipes. I love his stuff. Um, I might be on. I might have my a food show soon. Can't say much more than that, but I might have a food show soon. But that's a lot. You just said. no. I feel like there's like way more I could say, but I don't want to say it and jinx it because they don't know who with what with all it. You know what I mean? But there might be a you show with food. Even guess. You couldn't even guess. You couldn't guess. That's why I'm like trying to say uh -uh. food because they couldn't even guess. Although Trisha Yearwood had a, tr a cooking show, so if that Trisha gets tired, maybe they still have the sign that says like cooking with Trish. Maybe they'll want me to take over. She for doesn't her. do it anymore. Oh, she doesn't. No. Why? What happened? Garth Brooks has so much money she's finding to work and like well, um <laughs> and maybe she that's a lot of work I think no but you know what I would do is I have Moses be my sous chef and cut everything up for me like they do on those shows so that all I have to do is like mm -hmm. dump the things in because <laughs> I can do that I'm like it is so much better when someone cuts things for you like onions and stuff does that though Valerie had to do it herself are you sure? I, I feel like Valerie, Bert Valerie Even, Bertinelli. She, but Pioneer her. Woman too I feel like everything's all set up for her like I feel like everything's set like they probably can do it Hers. I'm not saying yeah Hers is it's just so much easier when that happens. Although yesterday I was very proud. I pretty much did everything myself. I was very proud of myself yesterday. The latkes, even that the potatoes I was shredding, I shredded them in a cheese shredder. I was very proud of myself. It's cheese and onion. You have a cheese shredder? Yeah, a grater. Food processor? Or no, pan? like a grater, like where you grate cheese. See, we all have to do it ourselves. I did too when I did my cooking on my YouTube. Yeah. I even did the kneading myself. There's like a machine that can knead the dough for you. I'm like, I'll do it. And I'll... Mm. I was doing so good in it. It's a workout. I was great. And then you put the flour on the counter and you just like. I was like, I was having so much fun. I can't wait for Malibu to like join me. Because I was honestly like, this is like really, really fun. I don't know. Maybe have your own cookie show. She can be on. Well, maybe not the show. Yeah, she could be on it. It'd be really good. But. Um, yeah. What? 
when she gets old enough to be big, call Matthew over to help her. <laughs> I, I feel like she'll be a big. I feel like she's gonna do really good at everything she does because she already is like that. She's so good at everything. Like she's strong. She's athletic. She's coordinated. Like I feel like she's just good at everything. She sings a little. <laughs> she talks. She laughs. I feel her age is way, uh, getting her down because she's ready to go. She's mm. flipping herself and she's. Oh my gosh, so she, happy, wants, so proud. she wants to talk. Oh yeah, she loves to She wants to talk and she wants to do so much. That's why I'm excited. Tomorrow we're going to Colleen's and I'm excited for her because her babies are like one. They just turned one. So I feel like I, should, I feel like she'll connect with like older girls, older kids. Because Andrew too, his kid, his daughter just turned one. And I was like, maybe she should go be friends with them because she's kind of like a one-year-old, you know, because I thought, oh, she's too little, but she kind of is. She kind of just likes to be around them. So we'll see. Because Colleen had texted me, she was shake because on the vlog after our photo shoot, I was like, she does not like sparkly dresses. Like she, you know, I was, she just, she just screams her head off when she's in a sparkly dress. And then Colleen's like, yeah, Macy doesn't like them either. I was like, okay, good. It's like, and oh, Lena the Plug had a photo shoot with her family like a couple days after. And she didn't even know about me because I had like, oh, whatever that day I had a little bit of a meltdown. And she was, oh, she was trying to coordinate, um, a photo shoot with a toddler she goes it's so hard and i'm like oh my god i'm like i'm so glad you posted this because i just had a meltdown i don't know what it was i couldn't get malibu malibu like could not you know she, she likes to be in photos and stuff like that but she didn't like those sparkly dresses so once it's irritated oh my god like just she screams her head off and then the napping schedule is difficult it was like hard so she did love the white fur collar we should have just kept her in that, that little head was there i love how she's looking at her truly What's this? I know. She kind of like her throne. <laughs> I, know. I know. I missed that because I was going to play face, Her face is. No, she was so cute. I missed that moment because she was, by the time I got up there, it was her nap time and we were trying to keep her up past mm -hmm. her nap time to take photos. And then I felt so sad because I was getting glam and I was like, God, I should have gotten glam. I should have done my own makeup. And, but then everyone on and YouTube was like, oh, how come you don't get glam anymore? So I thought I needed to get glam. But then I missed the opportunity oh. where she was smiley and she I was so she sad. Does, you guys. Oh. I know. That's what you I know. say. Everybody loves your own makeup. I know. I mean, I have fun glamming, but like, you know, when it's, when you have I'm a daughter, saying. you want to be up when she's up. So the fact you that she was. it's not as important. Yeah. For all you that say, ask why she don't get glam, it's not as important. Yeah. Your baby's more important. I know, because I really did the miss out. The moments are more important than. I missed out on her being awake and happy. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I was Sorry, rushing. We just, we took that moment to have a belly laugh. <laughs> Oh my god! I'm laughing like my mom from my belly. Oh, I love that though. Um, oh my god! I was just thinking that. Like it's so sad. Like I wish they like. You, I wish like I wish my grandparents could still be here. It's like kind of sad. Like when grandparents don't get to see like their great grandkids. You know what I mean? Because I remember mm. seeing like Grandma Phillips and stuff like that. And I was just thinking like, oh, it's like so cool to like. I don't know. I always thought it was cool to see mm. like older people and stuff. I don't know. But she's. I'm still sad she doesn't have like that. Or my uncle Joe. She's a great grandparent, does she? No. Oh wow. I know, it's really sad, and I feel sad that she won't get to meet Moses' dad. Like, I feel really sad about that. Like, I always felt sad about that, I so. I never met my, my, none of my grandpa's, my mom's dad died. He had passed. Oh, my really? My dad's dad was gone, so I didn't meet any of my grandpa's. That's, that's unusual. Mm -hmm. That is mm -hmm. weird. I think my dad, dude, never met his, grandpa's dad died when grandpa was, like, 10. Like, oh. an electric, like, electric, electric electrocution or something. Oh, real? Like wow. that. Yeah. That's really interesting. That's weird. Was an electrician? I don't, I don't know really what happened, but I know he died when grandpa was young, so my dad never met him. And I never met my grandma on my dad's side. And I was, like, really sad. So I'm, like, so fortunate. One thing I give, I do gratitude every morning. I always give thanks, and I always give thanks that, like, my parents got to see, get to see my kids. Like, I just really hope they get to meet all my gra all my children. Mm -hmm. So at least they have that, you know what I mean? Because I think that's, like, and that's why I'm thankful. And that's why I had the meltdown, because I was just like, I just want memories for our Christmas card. Because we, <laughs> you know what? I did get a photo back, but... <laughs> We kind of all, I mean, I look a little tense. Like, I kind of look a little crazy. But I'm still going to post it because, you know what? I was like, what? I, oh, I ordered holiday cards, too. I think they're going to be here tomorrow. Because I was like, you know what? I'm still going to send out holiday cards. We maybe don't look that happy in the photo. Because I was so stressed that day. Everyone else was fine. But I was, like, trying to hold back tears. Because I just felt like I missed Malibu. Like, I missed, like, her happy moments when she was smiling with everybody. And I was like, no. And I got so mad at myself, which was so stupid. I don't know. It's just, it's just hard to, whatever. But I'm glad that other moms go through it, too. And, like, they have, they feel it. Because I... You really did have a little bit of a meltdown over this Christmas card because I'm like, you don't know, like, who, you know, when's the last Christmas you're all going to be together? And I want memories and I want holiday cards and I just wanted it to be perfect. And we should just kept her in that dress though. She was so comfortable when we switched her in the sequins and she, <laughs> the one that Moses holding her is like, ah, she's just like not having those dresses, but we do our best, you know? And here we are. And here we are having Dairy Queen. <laughs> Trying to get you a sponsorship. I don't think Derek will respond to me. I love this. I'm going to eat all everybody. Why? Well, what? Mm. I don't know why mine was. Did yours have chunks in it? Mine was just meh. I'm coming. Mm -mm. First like of all, I'm actually full, but. 
If I wasn't, I would try it. I am too, but... If I wasn't, I would go get Baskin Robbins, but I'm so full. They mm. have, like, a cappuccino blast. It's, like, a frozen cappuccino. Oh, no, oh, my God. I'm, like, literally so full. That was, like, those cheese curds are sitting in my belly. Like, they're so good, but... They're a little heavy. <sighs> that was, like, the day I had that bar food when I was... The one I posted on Instagram. Oh, my God. I was... That Flannery's. Mm. That one, oh, my God. I was so good, but it, like, sat on my tummy all day because I was, like, okay, I'm not used to eating like this, but the nachos were good. I can not eat once a day when I eat this stuff. It's so full. Yeah, I like, would say I that. I want to go home and get my onesies. Oh wait, I'm yeah. not onesie. <laughs> my my Barbie onesies is a flan. You're like, gonna match oh. Malibu and her onesie. You guys will both have onesies on together. <laughs> we should get our baby onesie like that. I don't know what onesie she's wearing these days. She wore a black onesie for our anniversary, and like she was like a little burglar. <laughs> I love her little black um, hoodie. Oh, yeah, that was cute. That was a vibe, the Wednesday Adams. I love her outfit. But people call her a boy. When we went to Barnes & Noble, people oh, were literally man. like, oh, what's his name? I'm like, oh, really? Why would you just assume that it's a boy? Oh, why are you like, talking to me? You're a stranger. Okay. Well, she was checking us out. And a nice little old lady that was, like, excited. She's like, oh, he's beautiful. And then she's like, what's his name? I'm like, Malibu. I know. That's why I was like, you know, I'm not going to even correct her. I felt so bad because it was, like, there was a huge line. There was, like, 30 people in line at Barnes & Noble, and there was one person, and she was older, and she, like, was entering <laughs> everything manually. I felt so bad. I'm like, oh, my God. And then she was talking. Manually? Why? I don't know. She was, was like, the things down? Do you, do you register? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think. I don't know. But then she was trying to talk to Malibu while she's, I'm like, oh, my God, there's a huge line behind us, lady, but it happens. I felt bad. I did feel bad. I'm like, that would be, like, a lot, so. Well, I guess they're trying to cut down on help. <laughs> I know. I was like, it's the yeah. holiday season. And it's off, was it off here? Yeah, it was right by the one near us by Farfella. Ah. Uh, we went to Farfella. That was, that was happening too. Oh, that was Friday night. And we went after Zach's Zane show. That I was really happening. I don't know when it's I don't know why. It's like six o'clock. I think you don't go out. You I go out too early. You got to go out like six. It's not that early. I went to Mastro. Oh, you know, yeah. We're the only good looking men. Yeah, I go, oh, well, if it shows me, yeah, but that was eight o'clock, mom. Well, you Where need to go out like at five. Mom, you need to go at six. I'm gonna go out with you. I'll take uh, you out. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, it's so cold. Oh it's God. like I got a nose freeze in my throat. Oh, are you okay? <laughs> I like your um, blush today. Your blush is very pretty. Oh, you did the highlight. I did, I did three too. things, sir. I did the highlight too. I, I put lashes on for you. I did eyeliner. I was like, I don't I know. know. My mom always has lashes, and I the one ASMR has like two hundred thousand views now, and I had no eyelashes. I'm looking so like pale next to my mom. I'm like, oh my god, why did I not wear more eyelashes that day? I didn't know you were gonna be so glam. That's my most popular video. You know no, it's not. You have one more. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was like my most popular video. I don't know I what think happened. Came through before. Oh my god. Okay. Well, I'll start heading home because I'm not, That scared me. Wait, why did he stop, though? <laughs> I was like, I ah! the second time he walked by. Oh, my did God. Did I see him in the mirror? Huh? No, it's fine. I mean, I don't really care, but sometimes I get a little nervous when we're just by ourselves. So I'm just like, okay. <laughs> Anyways. I've got pepper spray. I got that. I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. Like, am I supposed to roll out the window? Anyway, sorry. No, okay. you don't. You can't. You I know. Might. All right, thanks Little guys bit. so much Wait. for enjoying this. We'll see you guys okay, real going, soon. Everybody's coming now. Oh my god, what happened there? Why would that lady? I don't know. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh, she's taking you pulling out. Oh okay. my god. Well, I don't. Okay. Oh my god, she's running after me. Oh, uh, I'm just trying nothing. I, I know. Okay, me too. Okay, okay, okay. No, it's just like when we're like in the car. I just for a number of things. One, if we're eating, eating. But also, it's like you're in your car. It's like your house. It's like you want to come to someone's house and be like, mm -hmm. um, hi, can you come out? Although someone did do that for the apartments I lived at the Palazzo. I remember someone came to my apartment and asked me to come out and meet her daughter that was staying, or her daughter's friend that was staying with her. And then they push you in the car and you're kidnapped. I know. The channel, they'll grab you and pull you out of the car. Oh, I know. I'm not even like so paranoid like my mom, but I, I still am like, I'm not going to roll my window down. It's just not safe. And also like, I don't know. I get it. I get it because I'm in this pink car. That's the only reason I don't. I love this car so much. But I just don't drive it for that reason. And it's like, what if my daughter's in the back seat? You know what I mean? Like, I'm not going to. Because she was. Last time we went to the house, she was in the back seat. Kidnapping. No. Mm -hmm. And luckily, the locks back there are locked, so that's good. But, like, yeah, I don't. What is that lady? That lady, first of all, that lady did not look like a, someone that was like my fan. No. I don't know. It's probably like she probably had her daughter or something. I hate when people who like, don't know who I am, like, are like, oh, I don't know who you are. But my, it's like, okay, then just. Did she take a video? Oh, now see, now I'm going to get paranoid that it's going to go on TikTok like the other girl sitting crying me like, oh, she want to open her. Because I was like pulling away. <laughs> well, your people know why you don't. And they, you guys shouldn't either. Don't yeah. ever open your door. Don't open your window. It don't matter if you're well known or not well known. It was crazy. The one where we were at um, Portillo's and remember the mm -hmm. people like 
told us to, like ask us if we could buy them some food and people got so mad that we didn't i was like because again we don't know them like they're gonna follow us through the drive like i know it was weird like can you buy us some food and i'm like okay. i don't know just get out in public do your thing and get home that's in your that's invading your private space coming in your vehicle around your vehicle knocking on your window it was Who two in a them? row right there too i was like ah okay got time to go gotta go we did we got pretty lucky actually because we were sitting there for a little while so i'm kind of surprised that more people didn't come up but but if like if i'm like walking out or in dairy queen like it's fine like say hi to me like there's people in dairy queen say hi like i really don't mind that like obviously i'm out like you know whatever but in the car i don't know what it is i don't know why that bothers me so much but it just bothers me it's like this is your private i would be like annoyed and i'm not i'm nobody but if somebody came and knocked on my door i'd be like but no I, i'm i'm not putting a window down i don't know you i think that's the thing with anyone like whether you're on youtube or not you like nobody wants that nobody wants like you're having lunch in your car and then someone's like i don't know it's just like so weird and like yes i'm picking heath bar out of my teeth <laughs> with the thing with the finger. <coughs> oh there's a chilies here too oh my god okay there's so much happening um, oh look, they got little oh, hats on the dolphins. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, it's, a, it's a statue with like ten dolphins. They got like, Christmas hats on. That's really cute. I like that. Oh, yeah, that makes security. it so nice for the okay, holidays. Holidays. I know. Oh my gosh. It's they're here. Mm -hmm. They're gone. I'm gonna be so quick. Just in the next. Bye, week. raising cake. Bye. We'll be back. This is fun though. I like this. This oxide's a little bit of a vibe. I do like this. That's I, cute. I to get Kelly going out this way. Yeah, this is the vibe for sure. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. <laughs> Sorry for the abrupt. Well, I guess it wasn't that abrupt ending. <laughs> we probably were doing an hour, but it was great. Thanks for having lunch with us. Oh my god, it is one o'clock. I thought we were gonna be home by like twelve thirty. I think Mosey can go for lunch. He'll go for lunch at one. He likes to eat late anyway. So, all right, guys. Love you, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.